Hello YouTube, welcome back to Train Sim World. Uh, last time out I was doing some more tutorials. This time we're going to be going into one of the scenarios. I think I'm going to go on the clear cut scenario. Obviously I'm still grabbing some uh, some footage for the Total Reviews episode that will be coming uh, in partnership with Games Planet with the Great Western Mainline as well. Um, thank you to them for giving me this giving me this title to have a look at. And of course, if you do want to pick it up before the Great um, before the Great Western Railway expansion is out it's 50% off on games planet so that should be up on the screen right now and if not 20% flat discount is available from games planet for both the train sim world CSX CSX heavy haul and train sim world great western express so uh, game links are in the description box below do go check them out anyway getting right on with it that's that done clear cut is the one we're going to do I'm going to do this in two parts so we're going to do a uh, probably 20, 20, 25 minutes on each. Let's see. Odds are it's going to take me a lot longer to do all of this. We're working in in this area. It looks like we're going to be using the turntable and all that kind of stuff. There's work to be done in a Cumberland terminal, switch and service the required locomotives. Let's uh, start. Right, so we are uh, down at number 14, as you can see, which is quite far down. And... Well, we're gonna see. We're gonna see what we can do. I have no idea what to expect. I've not done this before. It's not like uh, I've practiced. I really haven't. So we're going to we're going to have to see. Is it about? I'm assuming this has got to be all fueling. Maybe getting trains consists uh, set up and stuff like that. You know, it's working in a rail yard. That's that's exactly what it is, uh, which is going to be quite interesting. A depot, a yard, whatever you want to call it. I think it's gonna be quite cool. It's a shame I can't do the in-depth maintenance. Uh, like I, like I mentioned in the last episode, I think, uh, my uncle actually works on the railways and he does maintain these. And in winter, it's a nightmare. You know, you have a blowtorch to de-ice the trains, uh, but a couple as a frozen or something. Right, so we've got one, two, is that two trains? I think that's two trains that we're looking at. Take that screenshot right there. Uh, climb aboard a locomotive that needs moving. Hey, you're in yard duty today. Several, okay. All right. Well, oh, there's okay. All right, all right. Uh, oh, there's is there one up there? No, no. Let's let's climb aboard this one. How do I? Oh, it's this one. Reward earned. Use a door. Yay! Reward earned. Figure out how not to use a door. Ow! Oh my god. Uh. You know, I'm going to leave that door open. Alright. Here we are. Uh, I want to sit in my seat. Alright, what do we have to do on this one? Oh, don't tell me this wasn't a locomotive that needed moving. Did I, did I just completely get that wrong? I probably did. Right, well that's... Is this not a locomotive that needed moving? No, it's not a locomotive that needs moving. It's that locomotive over there. All right, look at that. Old and new. This one needs moving, apparently. Let's go. Yeah, this one needs moving. Okay. Wow. How did I get that one so wrong? Okay. Alright, so ditch and gauge lights need to go on and front headlights need to go to bright. Very well. Let's do that. Let's switch on the ditch lights, the gauge light. Uh, come on, gauge light. Okay, I can't actually get to those. Oh gosh. Um, maybe if I did that. No, no. No, no. No. Mm. Can't actually switch that. Here we go. I don't really need them on, do I? But that's fine. I switch them off now. Because I don't need them. Alright, couple to the coal train. Right, let's have a look at that. Make sure it's fine. Yep, that's going 
that way I need to now figure out what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna look out the window make sure I can figure out that that is the train I'm going to that way and along that way yep that looks good all right let's uh, uh, bell 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 there's a bell on this train don't know anyway we're going to stick that in forward there we go dynamic brake off automatic brake off independent brake off just let people know and we'll move this along we'll keep an eye out the window here oh good reflections it does something weird there but good reflections Oh, that's kind of cool. That is kind of cool to see. So this is our coal train. Uh, looks like we're switching over again. Yep. Looks like we're going to go through the fueling yard. So crank ourselves up to about 15 miles per hour. I think we're good. We're cleared for... Actually, we've got 10. Okay, we're, we're cleared for 10. 15's up there. I wonder if I can exceed 10. Let me see if I can exceed 10 here. No, it doesn't let me exceed 10. Interesting. So I can just leave it in... Oh, no, 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 no. I am definitely exceeding 10. But it's not putting any power in. It's like it's got some sort of cruise control on. Look, if you look. It's, yeah, it's not really giving me much power. Interesting. Very interesting. So I'm just going to leave it at that. I just want to see if it if it exceeds it. Because otherwise, I'm, I'm fairly sorted here. I can just sit here and uh, wait for these to go around. Right, let's have a look everywhere. Make sure everything's okay. So that's doing something weird. Yeah. It looks okay here. Stick our head out the window again. So nobody's here. I want to have someone like standing there and you yell out the window, All right, Jeff! Or John, or Mark, or... I don't know, uh, give me some other names. Emily, maybe? Joanna? Just random names now. Right, so this should now let me go up to 15 in 3, 2, 1, 15. That's not happened. Why has it not happened? There it goes. Is that going to let me go up to 15 though? I don't think so. Maybe, maybe Notch 1 is just, uh, yeah, notch one just lets you get up to... Interesting. So what does notch two do? Does that let me go even faster? Yes, it does. So notch one will only let you get to about 10 miles per hour. Very cool. That's an interesting view to have, isn't it? Leaning out, you can't see yourself. It's like you're just sitting out. It's like you're just sitting out here. Like a dog. Stick your, stick your tongue out the window. Open that window as well. This is the sort of thing I would probably do. Just sit. Like this. Excuse me. Someone was in me. Right. Now I am a little lost, coupled to coal train. Is the coal train ahead of me, behind me? Oh, don't tell me I've done this wrong. I don't know. I, I may have to... hold on. Hold on, hang on. I may have to work this out for myself. 
So I'm going to actually hit the brakes here now. Yeah, I'm just going to get myself clear of that switch, which I now am. I'm just going to slow this train down. Yeah, now I think I have to back it up. Oh, gosh. Or is it over there? Maybe it's two miles that way. I don't know. I'm about to find out now. Let's have a look. Let's go up in the air so we can have a look. In fact, does 9 give me a map? Yes, it does. Great. All right, so we are now here. And that's where we that's sort of where we came from. Now we want to hook up. <sighs> Alright, we want to hook up to this coal train. Now I wasn't told that. No, I was told that, but I wasn't told where we Oh no, hold on. We must have come from Ah, we came from over here. So now what we need to do is if we can back ourselves up along here past the coal train that we want to hook up to that way we'll know yeah let's do that okay i've got it so what we're going to do is we're going to back ourselves up no come on i, I want to is this just going to take me back down this route I don't want it to take me down that route i know where i want to go There we go, okay. So I'm gonna go down there. That's the coal train. So I'm gonna go down there, along there. There doesn't seem to be anything in this one here, so we'll go along this one, right alongside the coal train. We'll take that one, not that one, that one. Yep, up to there, and then we'll back it up onto the coal train. Absolutely fine. Great. Okay. So now, time for us to back it up. Here we go. Now, this may be the long, stupid way of doing things, but hey, I've never done this before, so you gotta cut me some slack. So how was I managing to hold that before? I need to go look at the other window now. Not that. Not there. There we go. Hopefully this is taking me the right way. Wait, isn't that the coal? Oh no, there's the coal train. Great. Oh, we're not. We're not doing so bad. We're not doing so badly at all. Yeah, no, 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 we're doing, we're doing a good job. We're doing a good job here. That's fine. It doesn't even look like a mile away, but, you know, that's fine. Because I wanted to. It's okay, lighting up the environment there. I like that. That's the coal train that we're hooking up to. So all we're going to do is go past this and bump ourselves into it. Simples. And then probably pull it out. Now, we could have done this a better way if we were smarter, but we're not so smart. So, uh... Now, what is that two miles thing? Over in that direction? I have no idea. It looks like a red signal, but... Maybe that's where we've got to pull the coal train to. And then what? We have to walk all the way back? That's just lame. Unless we've got to get a hitch a rider back. I don't know. Come on. Come on. Any time now. 15 minutes into the episode and I realised I went 
I either went the wrong way or I just haven't done the most effective route. That's all. We'll get it done though. Give it maybe two minutes or something. Two minutes or something should have us hooked up to this train. We're 300 yards away from the front of the train. Uh, but that being said, we do have to go maybe a couple of hundred yards up, up forward to switch track onto the onto the right track. But you know, we're, we're doing this. We're, we're getting it done. That window's not open. How am I? How am I sitting here? Quite a long train. Ooh, nice, uh, nice reflections there. Anyway, the Fresnel looks a little bit odd on that, but uh, that's okay. Overall, it's decent. Title's decent, right? So what we need to do is we need to get past. Uh, if I do that, we need to get past that bit there, and then that bit there, and then swing ourselves back on. Which really shouldn't be too much of an issue. So we're probably going 300 yards up. Oh, look at that train. Is that going to need hauling out as well? No, I think that one's ready to go. And I told you it's about 300 yards up we're going. See, distances I can work out. So we just need to clear that. 200 yards there. A little bit more clearance. And... We look clear of that, so I'll start braking. There we go. About 250 yards. Come on, get ourselves brake. Brakes, brakes, brakes. There we go. Alright, now if I had a gun, I would shoot that. So I could just switch that over, but... I don't have a gun, so I'm going to have to go over here, and we're going to uh, switch it over like so. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Ah, no, that's fine. I just couldn't see it. Okay, that's, yeah, that's where we need to go. Alrighty. Uh, back to this. Stick ourselves in forward. And away we go, and we're going to go back to our usual seat, and look out this window here. And we'll be ready to couple any moment now. I'm actually now leaning over to have a look, but uh, that's a stupid thing to do. Alright, we're at about seven, 7 miles an hour, but we're going to slow it down. Let's slow it right down. We are essentially running the brakes here. Initial reduction. Idle that. We'll start servicing here. There we go. 8, 7... We'll reduce the brakes a little bit. There we go. Five. Release that. At four, we're going to slow down. A bit more service on that. Slow down to about two if we can. A bit more service. There we go. We're on. All right. Switch off any active lights on the locomotive. Well, that we can do. Uh, that one's active, and the ditch lights are active. We'll stick the brakes on on that. Auto brake, independent brake, fully done. Uh, that is in full service. In fact, the independent brake can come off. Uh, the reverser can go into neutral. We're good. Oh, now we have to walk to another locomotive. Oh my gosh, that's ridiculous. All right, we're already 20 minutes in. Oh no, that one does need moving. All right, we'll take that locomotive. Run, 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 run. Can we jump? 
space bar to jump. So you can just... Nope. So leap onto these planks, have a bit of fun. There's that train though. The speed that we can run backwards though, you saying bolt in reverse. Look at that. J turn. Up we go. It's another train, oil tank. Wow. Pop in here. Alrighty. Having just arrived in Cumberland, these need taking over to the locomotive shop for refueling and refreshment. Ah. Be sure to disconnect them from the rest of the train first. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Let's uh no, we're going to disconnect them first before doing what you're telling me to do. Because it, it would be stupid to... Let's get this off. That's disconnected. Alright, climb up and we'll set the headlights ready to go. Oops. that's where we'll end the episode once we get this going right that can go up that can go up right uh, no we don't need auxiliary do we yeah we've done that we've done that oh you you're seriously gonna make me go back here to see now this is where I think this is just a little bit silly look we've done this you see there you go right, up with her. Up we go, run, 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 run. Shut that door behind us. Alright, uh, release the brakes. There we go. Uh, release those brakes. Alrighty. We're getting all these uh, rewards for doing stuff right. Take it to the fuel shed. Stick that in forward. That would help. Alright, now let's have a look at where we where we need to get it. Over there. So we're gonna go up, and we've gotta get back, and then we've gotta go forward. Is there a train here? No. Alright, so we're going that way. That way, that way. Oh we've gotta we've got to go far we do. Alright. No, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Well, okay, okay, we've got to go far. That's fine. What I'll do is I'll probably uh, end the episode here, uh, and then we'll continue. We'll continue in the next episode. We'll just go seamless here. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Please remember to hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to the channel for more videos on. Uh, train sim world leave a comment in the comments box below let me know what you think of the title I'm playing and of course if you are considering picking this title up if you if you're sold already do check out the link in the description box below to games planet uh, you'll get the discount and if you're not so sold then um, you know uh, do do just wait that would that would be a, a good idea if you just if you just wait and uh, we'll we'll show we'll see what we can do uh, I'll obviously have the. There we go. I need to slow this. I need to slow this down. No, that's wrong. There we go. Slow down. Slow down. You know what? Use the independent. There we go. Uh, yeah. So I'll obviously have the total reviews episode coming up. Coming up, and uh, that will be that will be giving you a fair, fairly good idea. Hopefully. Right, just gonna. Double check that I'm clear. I am. We'll go back into that other mode. And uh, I'll join you guys in the next... Oh, I'm over here. And uh, I'll join you guys in the next episode where we'll finish off this this mission. Which is actually kind of interesting. if Even though it does it result in a lot of uh, running around. So, thank you very much for watching once again. And I will see you guys next time in uh, Train Sim World.